Watford, as we know, unfortunately went down last season in the Premier League, so I wanted to try something. I wanted to give them Erling Haaland for the season and see what would happen. Everything in this video will be simulated, so nothing will depend on my skill. I wanted to put Erling Haaland in their team from last season and just see what would happen. Would they stay up? Would they still go down? Would Haaland score many goals? Uh, yeah, let's see. Let's uh, jump into it and find out. So I didn't want to change things up too much. I've literally just put Haaland in to partner Emmanuel Dennis. Uh, Josh King has moved to the bench. So yeah, he's literally just slotting into the team that they had last season. Let's see if they can stay up. All right, let's have a look. Now, Watford are six games into the season with Erling Haaland. They are yet to win a game. They've drawn three, lost three, uh, scored eight goals and conceded 13. So let's have a look how Haaland himself is getting on. So we can see here, Haaland hasn't had an amazing start to the season. Uh, he's played all six Premier League games, but only scored the one. And the only other thing he's done is got an assist in the Carabao Cup. So a bit of a slow start from Erling. Let's see how we go in the next two months. Three months in now, and Watford are down in the relegation zone. It's not looking great. Uh, seven points gained. Uh, they've drawn seven games, lost six, and still are yet to win a game. So let's have a look how Haaland's going. So Haaland currently on a red card, but also struggling big time this season. He's got three goals in the league out of only 13 games, maybe just not getting the service that he's used to. And uh, the assists, he's got, a, he's got a Premier League assist now, but that is literally it. Um, another slow two months for Haaland. Let's see if he can pick things up and save Watford from relegation. Okay, we are now at the start of February and things are looking a little bit better. Uh, they're up to 18th Watford, they're on 16 points, they're only a point off of being out of the relegation zone. Uh, they've picked up two wins, which is nice to see, 10 draws and 11 losses. Let's have a look at how Haaland's getting on. Alright, looks like another slow month for Haaland, I'm not entirely sure why. Uh, he's playing plenty of games, he's just not finding the back of the net. I guess playing in a lesser team, you know, he's going to have less chances. So, let's see how he goes in the next two months, there's four months left. Let's see if Haaland is the man that can keep them up. I'm not sure. Well, I guess we're not going to find out our answer. Uh, I've been sacked. Let me see if I can work a way around this. Great news. Norwich gave us a job. Let's continue. <laughs> so with only eight games left to play in the league, Watford are now eight points off of being safe. So I don't think it's going to happen. I don't think the addition of Erling Haaland will be enough to keep that Watford side up. Let's finish it off anyway and see how they go. Norwich sacked me as well. Good news, Brentford have given me a chance. Let's finish the season. Okay, here is the results of this little experiment. No, Erling Haaland cannot keep Watford in the Premier League, at least as far as FIFA is concerned. Uh, Brentford, Watford and Norwich all go down. And uh, let's have a look at how Haaland finished the season up stats-wise. Unfortunately, because I'm no longer the manager of Watford, I can't see how many goals he scored uh, to end the season off. He didn't score over 11, we know that. However, we can see that he registered six assists, leading the uh, assists for Watford, I believe. Yes, so he got the leading assist getter for the club, I guess. Uh, but it was not enough to keep them up. So there's our answer. Erling Haaland cannot keep that terrible Watford side in the Premier League. I think they were always destined to go down, but he got to fulfill his dream of playing with Ben Foster. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. I'll catch you on the next one. Please subscribe and leave a like if you enjoyed. Cheers.